All right, guys, back here again with the babies. Uh, we got a problem, though. The two white hens is picking on the little black hen right behind there uh, with her three chicks. Haven't seen them pick on the chicks, but every time she walks out, they, uh, they don't like it. Oh, there. Yep, there she goes. I don't know. Um, I really don't want to set up another chicken tractor, brooder, or whatever you want to call it. I did bring the stuff today to set up a five gallon waterer so that I don't have to really worry about them running out of water. But this could propose a whole different problem. I don't know. I'll let you know what I figure out. Oh, there, there they come. They're going to come out here and try and grab some of these snacks that I threw out. Let's see if the hens are aggressive towards the chicks or just the mama. Here comes the hen. It doesn't look like they tried to get any of the chicks, just mama. Oh, well, maybe. Maybe they just squealed because she got skirt. I don't know. Either way, it's not a good way for the black one to live. So I probably will have to set up something. Which... Lovely, lovely. Because I do want her to be with the chicks for another couple of weeks. Then I can pull the mamas and send them back on their way. But I like for them to usually have... I like for them to usually have you know, several weeks. Uh, I don't know, that heifer may be going after them babies. Take one of them white ones and put it up. It looks like that one's big enough to keep them all warm. Ain't no real reason to have that little rude one over there. She can go back in the pen and, in fact, I believe that's what's gonna happen. But she done ticked me off. That one's big enough to keep them warm enough. It's not supposed to get real cold. Yep. Oh, yeah. That's it. So, yeah, guys, we we ended up having to move that one white. That one white hen. She was just being too aggressive. Um, so, these two seem to be getting along fine. The black one has been... Keeping her distance, but this white hen hadn't been chasing her or anything like that or messing with the chicks, so. Uh, problem adverted for now. Once the chicks get a little older, we'll just pull mamas out and uh, let them go back to chickening. But for now, 
all is happy on the farm. So I put some diametaceous earth in there. Feed just kind of threw it over on top of it, so maybe they can get a mouthful here and there. Yeah, get in here and clean this up. Staying up on top of that hay so it's drying out real well. Plenty of ventilation. But I need to get some more straw and clean that out.